Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Brother Shield. Today we're gonna come back to another test. Uh, in the last video, I think I did Bright Memory. Uh, the recording didn't go as well as I'd hoped, so I had to change a few things. This time I'm gonna use OBS to record. So, I already played Bright Memory, and this time I wanna play um, Telcel Vulcan. I can't pronounce that game, honestly. So, yeah, I wanna see how this game is gonna run. So, without further ado, let's begin! Bad fly. All right. Technology benchmark is designed to test performance mobile devices and show the quality of games that can now attain a certain level of next generation devices. It doesn't represent the full game, just a sneak peek of what's possible. Okay. Same is the same people who made um I think Dead Space no Dead Island no no not Dead Island <laughs> uh, Deep Space I think it was called. Yeah, last time when I tested this game, it ended up uh, crashing, so I want to try and, uh, uh, hold on, cancel, because it does have controller support, so character selection, uh, I'm going to go for a new character, on the beard. See how this plays out.
Badass opening. Badass. Tap aim and counter switch aim all. Don't waste ammo by shooting from the hip and the distant target. Don't let enemies to don't let enemies to get Okay. Everything is set to high. Uh, it does have controller support. Survive and find a way out. Uh, move over the house screen. I'm over the. Okay. Oh. Woo! We have some serious stutters. I think we're gonna have to do something with the settings. Everything's set to high, so we're gonna have to drop down a lot of the resolution scaling. So, resolutions down to ultra. Nope, very far. Just set everything to medium. There's no way the device can handle it. As awesome as it is to have it high, the stutter is real. Say far, drop down the resolution scale. It's like playing the PC, except that was on Android. All right, let's apply that. Okay, back. Uh, let's return. Let's see how it runs now. All right, medium. We're getting better, better speeds at least. big game. Survive and find a way out. Okay. What's that? Poison mists. Damn. Oh man, it's really hostile. Alright, let's find a way out of here. Is there another weapon? Oh, there we go. Yeah, the auto shoot is on. Uh, the auto shoot is on. So controls. Yeah, I want to turn off auto shoot. Game. It only shoots when I aim at the uh, target. Doesn't seem to have it, huh? Uh, I'll try and make do. But just. Uh, to get a bit more better speed. Let me just set those down. This is just to get a slightly better speed. And let's continue.
Damn, these things are fast. Uh, the aiming is a bit slow, though. But then this is more of an open world game. The hell? Damn it. Stand still. Now how do I heal? I can't shoot those, can I? Better gaming experience. my weapon. I'll try to follow that ugly guy. Why? Oh, guy. You better not be following the monster, man. You want to find a way out. Oh, maybe it will lead us somewhere. Borderlands vibe though. It's real, man.
shit. Damn, this thing's fast. Dig, I see. And stay down. Jeez. Find a way out. Oh, that takes care of that. Yeah, last time when I was here, I think it crashed. There must be a way out. Gives me some archive vibes as well. Thank you for playing Test Unknown. Uh, we hope you enjoyed this short preview that's trying to show quality of games that is now possible on mobiles. It's a huge undertaking that requires a lot of resources, so we're always looking for, always looking for partners that are interested in breaking the limits of the mobile gaming market. Yeah, imagine getting this to run on the PS Vita. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Yeah, unfortunately this game only works for 64 bits, so if they can add 32 bit support and if they can find a way to make it work on 32 bits and ARM 7, bruh, <laughs> bruh, that is truly breaking, well then again, Vita's already broken the limits many times, but anyway, that was just a quick test to see how this game runs, so yes, this recording is better, I think using OBS is a lot better. So anyways guys, thank you so much for sticking with me, and uh, if I can, I'll try and get this... I'll try and do another walkthrough on this on uh, the Nvidia Shield. So hopefully that, that will work out better. Uh, exit. Uh, doesn't seem to work all that much. So anyways guys, thank you so much for sticking with me on this long journey. I will try and get these games running on Nvidia Shield or at least find a way to get it running. If it doesn't, well, uh, it doesn't work. If it does work, well, that's epic. So, high-end mobile games, hold on, let me just slow this. High-end mobile games, I'll be mostly be playing on the MoQ. If I can't get them to run on the Shield, I'll mostly test out these games on the MoQ. So, anyways, guys, thank you so much for sticking with me in this video. This has been your boy, Brother Shield. Take care and peace. Bitube.tv